Okay, so this is an example of the technology that we used in the patient. Um, uh, this is a lab version of that technology. So what this is, is a high intensity focused ultrasound unit or a HIFU unit. Um, if you look down into this area here, you can see that there's um, the ultrasound transducer. So it's similar to what you would see in an imaging type of um, uh, probe um, that is able to focus ultrasound beams into a very small point. And what we're seeing here is the ultrasound energy being transmitted at one watt, which is a fairly low energy. So you can see that it's actually got a very small little pinpoint of water that's forming on the surface. Now, if we were to increase that energy, you would see a big change. And let's, uh, let's try to do that and see what happens here. Okay, so this is similar to the type of energy that we were using in the patient to do the procedure. And as you can see, there's a big difference in the way that the water looks. So when this happens within tissues, it's actually able to heat the tissues in a very specific way. And that's why we use the MR to monitor and to target the ultrasound beam. So with imaging ultrasound, it actually send ult sends ultrasound waves into tissues in a very kind of diffuse pattern. And those bounce off and they come back and you make a picture with that. Now if you take those same waves and you actually put them into a point, and with this type of technology, that's what it's built to do, is to concentrate into a much smaller area than imaging ultrasound you can increase the amount of energy by somewhere around 10,000 times. So the way that the ultrasound waves work is they actually have um, the ability to generate heat and pressure at that point. This technology actually allows the ultrasound beam to be focused into a very small area. And the result of that is that um, you have an area of burn that's about the size of a grain of rice.